I'm here at Meshera Metro Station in the center of Doha, not to take Metro, but to take a different form of public transport. Let's go. Welcome to the secrets of Doha's Musharraf tram. Number one, the tram runs in a loop. So what's this? Junction. It's a junction. We love a good junction. This is Kahraba Street, and the tram almost always keeps heading south at this point. But it can turn left onto Mariah Street like this. There's even a secret station on this road. And then a little way after it, the track rejoins the main route on Sikkat Wadi Musharab. So why two lines? Well, it's a backup route. So if there are roadworks or track repairs on Sikkat Wadi Musharab, the main route, then trams can divert. So if you see one heading that way, jump on it. It's an extremely rare route. <laughs> Two, did you know you can have a look inside the tram depot? Back on Kahraba Street, which, by the way, was the first road in the country to get electricity. Kahraba means electricity in Arabic. And you'll see the track branch off into a building. This little sign helps point the way. And then you're looking for this massive metal gate. This is where the network's three single car tram units sleep at night. You might even see their special repair truck that can fix damage to the track. And this is the maintenance bay where engineers can get right underneath the tram. Ready for number three? Let's go and find Musharab Tram's abandoned station. This is called the Musharab Prayer Station, also known as the Friday Prayer Stop and it's right opposite the main mosque in Sharon. But trams don't stop here. So what happens is you have this little junction going on here and most trams just continue straight through there instead of taking the loop off of it to stop here at this stop and then rejoin the main line there. It's not clear why trams don't use this stop it may be a future stop, it may be something for future planning. No idea. I thought potentially trams might stop here on Fridays for Friday prayer. They also don't because the tram's not running at Friday prayer time. So if you know why this station does not receive trams, please let me know. Okay, look, let's be real for a second. The tram does a tiny two kilometer circuit. It makes nine stops, it takes about 18 minutes to get around. The tram runs about every six minutes, but the stops are so close. And even if you wanted to walk from one side of the network, one side of the little loop to the other, I don't think it would take you six minutes. So is it ever gonna be worth sitting down and waiting for a tram if you just missed one? Probably not. But maybe that kind of misses the point. Stop looking at the tram. No, seriously, stop. Look up. See these buildings? Narrow windows, thick walls, no glass towers in sight. The Musharab neighbourhood is the world's first sustainable downtown regeneration project. And the electric tram and its self-powered depot is a big part of that. It's a statement of purpose. It's not about the mass movement of people. It's showing the car drivers of the Gulf that another world is not just possible, but more fun. So if you're in Doha, get out of the car, onto the tram and help to make this city a tiny bit greener. Just like that tram. Like and follow for more and enjoy the ride.